Welcome ladies and gentlemen. So what I'd like to do is show you how to simplify uh, this radical expression. And the first thing we want to do is simplify the radicals. Simplify the radicals. Simplify the radicals. Um, so to go and do that, I need to, you know, you could factorize these numbers. And when you're taking the cube root, you know, determine what pairs are, um, or not pairs, but a groups of three of the same prime factors, you can do it. But I think the easiest way, um, once you kind of get an understanding of prime factorization, is just to look at your cubed numbers here and say, can I rewrite either my radicands as a product of one of these cubed numbers? And you see that both 16 and 32, I can rewrite as the product um, as with 8. So therefore, I'm going to rewrite this 7 times the cube root of 8 times 4 times 2 times the cube root of 8 times 2. And what's important about that is I know the cube root of 8 because the cube root of 8 says what number multiplied by itself 3 times gives us 8, which is 2. 2 times 2 times 2 is 8. So therefore, I can rewrite this as 7 times the cube root of 8 is 2. I don't know the cube root of 4, so I have to leave that under its radicand times 2 times the cube root of what of 2 again. Cube root of 8 is just 2 times the cube root of 2. Now I can multiply here, and I can actually I can actually rewrite this as 7 times 2 times 2 times 2 times the cube root of 4 times the cube root of 2. Multiplying all these numbers here, I have 2 times 2 times 2 is 8 times 7 is 56. Then the cube root of 4 times the cube root of 2, following my rules of radicals, I can multiply the 4 times 2 which gives me um, 4, or cube root of 8, which we know is just 2. So I have 56 times 2. And 56 times 2 is going to be 116. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you simplify the product of two cube roots. Thank you.